All right, Watson, let's put together a puzzle, shall we? There are 12 pieces here. Let's try to gather them. Oh, man. Rotate and swap mold pieces depending on their shape to position them in accordance with each other. <gasps> oh, my goodness. This is a puzzle. All right, so... You... Oh, wait, no, 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 no. This and this swap. Okay, so you and you swap. Okay. And then... Okay, so... Ah, every time I let go, it won't let me, uh... This is like a survivor puzzle. Okay, I want to find the ones with the flat tops. They, they will go in the four corners. Alright, so you go on top. You, you guys swap. And then you've got a flat top, and you have a flat top. All right, now, let's hold for vertical rotation. So, I wish I could turn these things. Like we're suddenly getting a lot closer. Oh, look at this, you guys. Look at this. Just turn you around a little bit. Zip, zap, zop. It is a mold, and it is ready for casting. Whoosh. The mold is prepared for casting. We just need to fill it with certain material. Uh-oh. So Rodney has made a reconstruction of the mythical golden knife. Hmm. He seemed unafraid of maledictions, and yet... Half a glass of water should be enough to create a plaster solution. Half a glass. Let's see what we have here. Let's not dump it out. Hmm. This knife is very similar to that described by the coroner as the weapon that killed Sir Rodney. You should not leap to any hasty conclusions, Watson. Yeah, that seemed really hasty. All right. Mold form and strange wound. Got to be it. The mold was used to create the murder weapon. <gasps> Another idea. Check if we can create a silver knife with the materials found. I... Let us try to create an object from silver by using the mold. Okay. Silver. You going here. You burn. It will take a minute to melt the silver with my gas burner. Okay. Done. Quick. Now I can proceed further. <laughs> All right. Take and pour. I turn the gas off, huh? I should wait for it to cool down. I'm going to burn my pot. It has cooled down. Now I can proceed further. <laughs> Should I turn this off? I can't. Take. Rotate. Open. Take. Examine. Homemade silver knife. Excellent. 
We have created a knife with the silver that we found. It could have been used to kill Sir Rodney. Elementary. It's extremely clever to create a weapon that could dissolve at the scene of the crime. Silver knife. Uh. The silver weapon was used and then destroyed in the brazier after the crime. All right. All right, we're getting somewhere now. These don't go with anything. All right. Wait, what was this thing up here? Find out where he was. Okay. Yeah, I gotta talk to somebody about... The Mithraic Mysteries and the Cult of Mithras. Alright, who do I talk to about that? Let's go back to the, um... And if nothing else, we'll check out the Frigidarium. Alright, let's go to the, uh, Strand Lane Bath. I still don't get if it wasn't open yet, why they were using it. A little weird. Mr. Holmes, we've cleared the corridor to the Frigidarium. You can visit it now. Thank you, Mr. Phillips. Hey, Phillips, what can you tell me about, uh, Mithras? All these events are bad Never for mind. the baths. And my job. Anything else in here? Just being thorough. Henry David Thorough. Heh. I made a smart joke. That had nothing to do with anything. Whoa! Hello. All right, you guys. What's up? Statue head. Don't be shy. Look at me. Hmm. What? Perhaps I could find some clues by activating the flagstones. Why not? Can't go around that way, really. Spider. And I guess one over here, huh? that thing a hidden symbol hmm okay what does that mean see I thought the flagstones were just the corners I don't think I did anything is there one here no. No. Alright. So I don't think I even checked this one here because I thought it was only going to be on a corner. Nothing to check. Oop. Here we go. Another symbol. A symbol. So these are the only ones with the options to push back. So I wonder what that means. I think, did the others have that option? So the ones without the symbol, can I push them back? I can. So let's only do the ones with the symbol. Or it's going to be vice versa. She who is. I'm 
Okay, he has a symbol. A hidden sign. Yes. Now I have all the clues to help me find where these symbols are leading. All I need is imagination. Yikes. Oh. Combine all three statue elements to reveal their secret. Okay, wait. Next figure. Um. Wow. So close. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Look at that. I knew you looked suspicious. The signs are pointing to this bust. Wait, what do you want me to RB? Yeah, I know. That's where I'm going. Eureka! Wait. Where was that at? That wasn't behind this bust? Where did that open up at? What the heck? Where did that open? You guys. Oh, right here. Weird. Oh! What is this place? I am unsure, Watson, but everything points to the fact that it was the last place visited by Sir Rodney Bentcliffe. We are approaching the end of this mystery. I still need to go back and figure out what's up with the bow, and the rope, and the hooks, and those three statues. I didn't forget about you! A broken glass plate. What is it doing here? I should examine it at Baker Street. How oh, very peculiar. An ice maker. Why would Sir Rodney have brought such a device here? I don't know, but I'll take it. <laughs> that ice maker goes with a champagne. Whoa, what would what, 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 you take away my clues for? Champagne and... Oh, wait. Huh. Wait, unexplained clue. That was weird. Some of my clues went away. I don't know what they were. A sack of crude salt. Mind your P's and Q's, salt. Being very crude. This fresco resembles either a ladder or a hierarchy. Well, it resembles both, actually. Oh, the initiation grades of the cult of Mithras. Okay. This fresco resembles either a ladder. Still need to talk to somebody about that. I don't know who. Search the tunnels. Whoa. Okay, let's always go left. Wait, whoop. Mummified bodies. We're in some type of catacomb. The pillar collapsed a long time ago. Mummified bodies. We're in some... A shovel. Not from the Roman era. You're so smart, Sherlock. Mummified bodies. We're in some type of catacomb. 
mummified bodies. We are in some type of catacomb. Mummified. I bodies. am examining we are in some every type type last of one of them. Taking no chances. What is this? Of course, we won't find out. Mummified bodies. We are in. Oh, here we go. How dreadful. Judging by the broken orbit, this poor fellow met a death similar to Sir Rodney's. This shoe is not from the Roman era. It is medieval at best. This man was a tomb raider who met with an unfortunate end. By the eye he was punished, for he saw that he was not worthy. Dreadful. Ah, oh, it was Lara Croft's skeleton. Mummified bodies. Mummified bodies. Let's do them all. We can't? Ah. <laughs> Is there a book the in there? The fire casts a shadow upon the floor. Bull. Hmm. So there was a pillar there. Okay. So what does that tell me? Need to light this pillar, I guess. Let's examine the shadows. It resembles a bull. Nailed it. That is the symbol of Neptune, the god of the sea. It is very similar to the face of. Mithras. So we're missing one. This shadow seems to represent a bridge. The shadows show us the way to go. We will find Mithras after Neptune, the bull, and the bridge. Neptune, the bull, and the bridge. All right. So let's go back to the dig site, huh? All right. I knew it. I knew we'd be going back. Neptune the bull and the bridge. Neptune the bull and the bridge. 